it's a wizarding time harry potter and i always need to cheat and the deadly Hedos part one okay <laughs> so i actually found a t-shirt in my cabinet from ravenclaw and i was like oh my god it would be so cool to wear it but then i kind of forgot that i can't <laughs> anymore so hmm but I would like to know which house you are in because I retook the test because I was like, am I not a Hufflepuff though? And I again ended up in Ravenclaw. So it's interesting that even with trying to get in another house, I ended up in the same one. Anyway, what a shocker that last movie was. I actually took quite a break between the two movies because I was like, uh, <laughs> that Snape storyline hurt my soul so badly and I needed some time to get over that. And I assume that today we're going to be looking at more horcruxes. But I'm just like so disappointed in what happened with Dumbledore at the end. And I, I don't know, I'm, <laughs> I'm kind of like struggling a lot to watch another movie and be into it again. And I don't know if we're going to hear more about Snape or if that was like the wrap up on that one. But damn, that was so disappointing. And I was actually really rooting for him. Anyway. I'll just grab myself together and get ready for another one. I hope, like, I kind of hope that with the next two movies at the end, you will feel a lot better. But that cannot change, right? Right? He's not gonna come back, right? Is he gonna come back? Oh, Mary, don't be hopeful. Anyway, I'm really disappointed in Snape because I still was rooting for him and I cannot believe that he did that and I can keep rambling on about it but we're gonna watch the next movie so if you like it make sure to like and subscribe subscribing really helps commenting helps out the channel a lot as well and if you want to see the full reaction and also some exclusive movies like uh, oh I think I'm gonna upload Fiddler on the Roof soon on Patreon uh, and Better Call Saul some polls you can all find that on Patreon so thank you so much for checking that out Let's get into this train wreck. <laughs> These are dark times, there is no denying. But I say this to our citizenry. Oh my god, he's a guy from um, Love Actually, from All I Want for Christmas. This is their new place. What's she doing? Nee. Oh, I have chills everywhere. Oh, nee. No way. She's taking away their best thing. Oh my god, I'm like already always in tears. To what? To protect them? Erased herself? Man, I went from rooting for him so much to... I just wanted to... <laughs> oh! I was beginning to worry you had lost your way. I think some would argue he actually lost his way. I must be the one to kill Harry Potter. But... I face an unfortunate complication. My wand and Potter's share the same core. Oh. In some ways, twins. What do you want? Someone else to give up their wand? I must do it with another's wand. Can you also, like, work with another wand? Because they are so specific to the person. What about you? <laughs> I require your wand. <laughs> that was so high pitched. It is Miss Burbage's belief that muggles are not so different from us. Damn it. He has the best poker face. But then I'm also like, oh. He can kill Dumbledore himself, so why would he care about this? It's crazy because in the beginning you're like, oh, he lived in a cabinet under the stairs. That's horrible. But if you think about it, long time, that's so abusive. You're like his vet. Hi, y'all. 
It always feels great, right, in the beginning when everybody reunites. They won't know which Harry Potter is the real one. The real one. Or his voice lowered. No, if you think I'm going to let everyone risk their lives for me. I've I... never done that before, have I? Yeah. <laughs> Dude. Tastes like goblin piss. I have lots of experiences with that, dear Maddo. <laughs> Wow, we're, we're identical. identical. I brought you here 16 years ago. It seems only right that I should be the one to take you away now. Oh, it is touching though. That's true. Damn, it's kind of epic. Damn, they're all ready. You cannot use magic. Yeah, you need to go, go, go if it was all for nothing. Don't be a hero now. Oh god. Every time they mix themselves in the regular traffic. Oh damn, they just wanted to go on a nice weekend with their family. <laughs> I hope it doesn't fall off the motorcycle. <gasps> Neon! Nee! Is she gone? Defending him? God, what a nightmare. <laughs> they run us right from the start, Molly. We didn't stand a chance. I'm told we should have already been back. Oh, me. I'm Fred as well. <laughs> Okay, that's someone. For oh, Molly, boy. that's her whole family, right? Her sons, her husband. Stupid! What are you doing? Shh. What creature sat in the corner the first time Harry Potter visited my office in Hogwarts? Are you mad? What creature? Uh, Grindelow. Thank God he remembered. I'd be like, fuck, I'm dead. <laughs> the last words. Albus Dumbledore spoke to the pair of us. Harry is the best hope we have. Trust him. Well, yeah, that's not confronting whatsoever. Harry's like, oh, great. Aww. How are you feeling, Georgie? Saint-like. Come again? <laughs> Saint-like. I'm holy. I'm holy, Fred. Get it? Can they not, like, heal him? Mad Eye's dead. <gasps> oh, I forgot. Mundungus took one look at Voldemort and disapparated. Oh my god, he actually was not trustworthy. That's so sick. Nobody else is going to die. Not for me. For you. Sometimes you want to slap the guy, don't you? You think George took that curse for you? You may be the chosen one, mate. This is a whole lot bigger than that. Come with me. I'll leave Hermione. You're mad. We wouldn't last two days without her. Don't tell her I said that. <laughs> I have to start finding these Horcruxes. They're our only chance to beat him. And Everyone's gonna be so pissed if he leaves. Tonight's not the night, mate. Even Snape said it would be impractical to get him if he was there. And when Dumbledore destroyed the ring, you destroyed Tom Riddle's diary. He must have felt something. So that's two down, yeah. Where do we start? All good questions. <laughs> I think it's always important to keep doing these things when times are rough. To never forget that there's light in the darkness as well. Ooh. What's the Minister of Magic doing here? Dude, not today. The last will and testament of Albus Dumbledore. To Ronald Billius Weasley, I leave my Deluminator in the hope that when things... Oh, is it the Zap thing? Isn't that crazy? You've seen it in the first movie and now it's like coming back. To Hermione Jean Granger, I leave my copy of the Tales of Beedle the Bard. These are all going to be things that they need, right, for this movie. I leave the snitch he caught in his first Quidditch match at Hogwarts. Aww. Can't imagine how that will be useful. 
like the book probably has like a tip something and the illuminator probably is it's also useful but like a snitch dumbledore left you a second bequest the sword of godric gryffindor ah well then Unfortunately, the Sword of Gryffindor was not Dumbledore's to give away. As an important historical artifact, it belongs... To Harry. It came to him when he most needed it in the Chamber of Secrets. The sword may present itself to any worthy Gryffindor, Miss Granger. That does not make it that wizard's property. Damn, I don't know about the legal facts here. The sword is missing. Oh, great. Oh. She's so pretty! Xenophil is love good. We live just over the head. Harry doesn't want to talk to us right now. He's just too polite to say so. At least she got the social cue. Mm -hmm. A lot of us can learn from that. Dumbledore was always very private, even as a boy. Don't despair, Elpius. I'm told he's been thoroughly unriddled by Rita Skeeter. Rita and Bart. Could be Reb. Bathilda Backshaw. She's only the most celebrated magical historian of the last century. She was as close to the Dumbledores as anyone. Bethilda Bagshot lives at Godric's Hollow. Well, that's where she first met Dumbledore. You don't mean to say he lived there too? The family moved there after his father killed those three muggles. <laughs> it was quite the scandal. Are you sure you knew him at all? His father killed all those muggles? The ministry fallen. Minister of Magic dead. Wow, this is so bad. Where does he need to go? Where? Ooh, in front of a bus. Do you think we should go back? We're after you, mate. We put everyone in danger by going back. Are we not going to go back to Hogwarts at all? This movie? It's crazy. It almost doesn't seem right. <laughs> Unbothered. He was on the astronomy tower the night Snape killed Dumbledore. Wow, the fact that he remembers. Oblivion. Isn't it crazy to think that with one word somebody could wipe your memory? Yikes. Probably Madhouse idea in case Snape decided to come snooping. What a scary place to be. If you're by yourself. Ah, see? Now Lucius is like, God damn it, you ruined my wand for nothing. <laughs> Regulus Arcturus Black. R.A.B. <gasps> oh. I have stolen the real Horcrux and intend to destroy it. R.A.B. is Sirius's brother. Wasn't it a crazy one? Question is, did he actually destroy the real Horcrux? It's gonna be that crazy elf, the nasty one. <laughs> Creature. <laughs> Where's the other one? Creature doesn't know. Yes, but did you ever see it? <laughs> oh, he would like bonk. <laughs> did someone take it? Who was it, Creature? Mandamus Fletcher. Damn. They were like filled with bad people. This Mundungus guy, Snape. My father will hear about this. Oh my God, go back to law school. <laughs> Even here, I promise to restore this temple of tolerance to its former glory. She's still there as well. I thought it might open at your touch. The Dumbledore had hidden something inside it. Hmm. Oh my god! <laughs> Look at this! <laughs> Working together! You found a locket, am I right? Was it valuable? When some ministry aide comes up and asks to see me license. Who was she? The witch, do you know? Oh, me. No, like her popping up for a second is like, okay, but please. 
Don't give her more credit in this movie. Don't speak to anyone unless absolutely necessary. If we do that, then with a bit of luck, we'll get inside. And then... It gets really tricky. Correct. Hmm. This is completely mental. We've got all cracks to find. These poor people. It must be so funny to be an actor and you need to act like you're this teenage kid that feels a bit out of place. Oh. Very hard, Nick. You do realize I'm going downstairs, don't you, them all Downstairs? To interrogate your wife. Whoa! If my wife's blood status were in doubt, and the head of the Department of Magical Law Enforcement needed a job doing, I think I might just make that a priority. Oh, damn. Suddenly you feel really bad for this guy that you don't even know. <laughs> Seems like a Fred and George gimmick. Oh. Wait, what does that say? Damn, imagine having this elimination list. Morning. From. It's me. Harry. <laughs> <laughs> that makes it a whole bunch harder. Bloody cold down here. Oh. Would be nice if they can save her while they're at it. Wands only choose witches, and you are not a witch. You are. Tell them, Rich, tell them what I am. Oh my god. No way. Not even hidden. Taking his role very serious. Mm. Isn't that heart attack inducing? I also did one of those Patronus tests and apparently I have a squirrel and I'm like... <laughs> Could have been something cooler, you know, but I guess. We have to get out of the country, understand? Mary, do as I say. Whoa. Oh, nee, not at this. Now she's like, did I cheat? <laughs> Long story. Nice meeting you. It's Harry Potter. It's oh, no, Harry. this is so bad because they saved them, but now they might have a little quarrel. Damn, this place gets ruined every freaking time. Oh, whoa. Oh, quick, quick, quick. Hurry quickly in my bag. There's a bottle labeled Essence of Ditton. I know, yeah. just do it. Ah. Oh. Ron got splinched. Oh, Warren, it seems to be helping. There's no way that this is going to be easy. Oh. They know a lot of destructive spells. I'm really wondering if we're only at the third one right now. Like, how are we going to get the other four in time? Dumbledore sends you off to find all these Horcruxes, but doesn't tell you how to destroy them. Doesn't that bother you? Something with the snitch? Oh no. You know who has found Grigorovich? The one maker. But he wants something that Grigorovich used to have. It's as if his life depends on it. Another Horcrux, probably. I'm doing everything I can. You're not doing enough! What's up with him? Take it off. Better? Right. Or it makes him snappy. What? <laughs> no way! You just murder the principal and then you become the principal? Is that how life works? No. Wow, this society fell off quickly. What's that? 
They couldn't see her. No way. No visuals, no audio, but sense. Ron isn't strong enough to apparate. We'll go on foot. On the... Oh, he's wearing it and getting jealous. Oh my god. What? I'll tell you in a minute. Okay. The sword of Gryffindor. It's goblin made. Dirt and rust have no effect on the blade. It only takes in that which makes it stronger. Okay. Harry, you already destroyed so it's one Horcrux, right? The weapon to destroy it. In the Chamber of Secrets, you stab the basilisk with the sword of Gryffindor. Its blade is impregnated with basilisk venom. It can destroy Horcruxes. That's why Dumbledore left it to you in his will. But we don't have it! It's missing. I'm still here. For you to carry on. Don't let me spoil the fun. What's wrong? Nothing's wrong. If you've got something to say, don't be shy. But don't expect me to be grateful just because now there's another damn thing we've got to find. I thought you knew what you signed up for. Yeah, I thought I did too. Maybe we should take the locket. I thought you had a plan. I told you everything Dumbledore told me. And in case you haven't noticed, we have found a Horcrux already. Please yeah. take the Horcrux. You wouldn't be saying any of this if you hadn't been wearing it all day. She's like so nice about it, but I was just like, chill off. You think I don't know how this feels? Oh, you don't know how it feels. Your parents are dead. You have no family. Wow. Stop! Stop! Neo is ne 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 ne. This is not okay. And you? But he took it off and he's still acting like this. I did it. I thought you'd figure him out. Oh, that's horrible though. If she's like crazy in love with him. Uh, <laughs> I hope Ron doesn't come back right now because then it's like over and done. What are we doing? Oh my god, I can never look at Daniel Radcliffe again in the same way. <laughs> That's so cringe. <laughs> what the f is this? I'm sorry, like, poor fellow. Ah, because he ate it. Money. Wow, okay. Well, I didn't catch the first snitch with my hand. I almost swallowed it. Imagine if it went like... <laughs> I open it to close. Well, what do you think that means? I don't know. Lovely, another riddle. I found something as well. Meanwhile, Ron is just like zapping lights in and out everywhere. Looney's dad was wearing that at Phil and Fleur's wedding. I want to go to Godric's Hollow. It's where I was born, it's where my parents died. You know who almost died there? Why are we back to you know who? I think I've let me give you a haircut again. I feel like it's quite nice for doing this the first time. You've noticed. Peveril. Hey, Harry. Aw, oh, did he find his mom and dad? Can you put some flowers or is that not possible in winter? Is that the 30th of January? It's my birthday! Merry Christmas, no way! This is horrible though. Lily Potter. Oh my god, we share a birthday! Okay, anyway, sorry <laughs> for the interruption. Mary, there's some That's never a good sentence. <laughs> I think I know who that is. I don't like this, Harry. What? I like the house this is where they died Oh, nee, this is so traumatizing. We killed her, aren't we? Miss Bagshot, who is this man? Are we supposed to trust her? Because I don't feel like it. Uh. And me. He's kind of busy. No. 
Oh god. This is gonna be a spook moment, isn't it? Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Thank God, at least these movies build it up a little bit. So, what was going on there? Who was that? Why was she doing this? Who's that guy in the photo? Gallet Grindelwald. It's the thief I saw in Gagorovich's wand shop. Where's my wand, Hermione? I'm sorry. I tried to mend it, but wands are different. It's done. Leave me yours. Go inside and get warm. I'll take the locket as well. Uh, okay. And so she's been out of want now. This one swapping gives me a little bit of panic moments. That's his. Oh no, is he like um, daydreaming, seeing things, illusions, hallucinating? This is so dangerous. Yeah, you know what? Falling through the eyes seems like a safe bet to die. Oh no, kids don't ever do this. Oh, it's getting worse. No way, what? Oh, oh well, dude is dead in 30 seconds or 12. You know, is this real? Wouldn't that be really random that is just hidden in a forest? <gasps> yeah, then you can't go come up. <sighs> what? So it was him. Nothing affects me more than it affects you and Hermione. All the more reason. No, I can't. This is your moment, Ron Weasley. Let's go. <laughs> wow. Okay. Nightmare. Go, Ron. What? Oh. Wow. Imagine saying, like, someone saying all your worst fears to you. Oh, come on. <laughs> I'm in total shock. Did they have to record it like that? Or was there a lot of, uh... Like, damn, I would not even get that image out of my face, even if I knew it was fake. Like, that would be burned onto my eyeball forever. Only three to go. Oh, three to go? I cannot count. Wait, we had diary, ring, and locket. Am I missing something? Hi. Hey, I'm back. You guys were kissing naked. Donald Weasley, you show up here after weeks and you say, hey, weeks. Where's my wand, Harry? Where's my don't wand? give her the wand. Harry Potter, you give me my wand. Have it. <laughs> hey, surprise. I destroyed it. With the and how is it and you just happen to have the sword of Gryffindor? <laughs> <laughs> oh, what a night. I just didn't know how to find you. Yeah, how did you find us? With this, it doesn't just turn off lights, a voice. Your voice, Hermione. What? And what exactly did I say, may I ask? My name. This tiny ball of light appeared, floated toward me, went right to my chest, straight through me. I want to make a super dirty oh, yeah. joke, but I won't. <laughs> I also would know what to say. You need a wand, don't you? Yeah. I've got one here. It's a black form. 10 inches. He just got a wand on him. Just just like that. And go, just... What you go? What's going on in there? Nothing. Nothing. <gasps> Might need a bit of practice. Look at the signature. It's the mark again. Hermione's right. We ought to see Lovegood. <laughs> I feel like he's going to be very agreeable for the foreseeable future. I'm always like that one. <laughs> <laughs> Uh, 
that's true love. <laughs> Could we come in? What a place to put your house. Just like, hmm, this is the middle of nowhere. Plump. It was about something you were wearing around your neck at the wedding. It was a symbol. Well, it's the sign of the Deathly Hallows, of course. Ah, the first time we actually hear about them. I assume you're all familiar with the tale of the three brothers. Yeah. Yes. No. <laughs> there were once three brothers. The brothers reached a river too treacherous to pass. They found their path blocked by a hooded figure. It was death, and he felt cheated. Damn. That each had earned a prize for having been clever enough to evade him. The oldest asked for a wand more powerful than any in existence. So Death fashioned him one from an elder tree that stood nearby. The second brother decided he wanted to humiliate Death even further. I never know like how people decide so quickly what they want. So Death plucked a stone from the river and offered it to him. Death turned to the third brother. He asked for something that would allow him to go forth from that place without being followed by Death. But Death reluctantly handed over his own cloak of invisibility. Oh, what? The first brother traveled to a distant village. He killed a wizard with whom he had once quarreled. And Death won again. Another wizard stole the wand and slit the brother's throat for good measure. Ooh. Whoa! The second brother journeyed to his home. To his delight, the girl he'd once hoped to marry before her untimely death appeared before him. That seems so nice, though. For she did not belong in the mortal world. Oh. The second brother killed himself so as to join her. And so death took the second brother. Wow, damn. Death searched for many years but was never able to find him. He then greeted death as an old friend and went with him gladly. Damn, he decided when it was his time to go. I'm sorry, sir, I still don't quite understand. Is that like the Philosopher's Stone? The cloak we've seen already too? But which is the wand? Yikes. But your tea's gone cold. I'll be right back. It's no matter, we really should be going anyway. No, you can't! They really want to be going anyway. They were angry, you see, about what I'd been writing. So they took her. Oh, nee, 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 nee. But it's really you they want. Oh, nee, nee, step back. Oh my god, it was a bait to switch him for Luna. Luna would never have approved of this. Oh my god. Oh man, I kind of feel bad for the fellow because he took his daughter and he's trying to get her back and now his house is gone as well. Uh, bad luck. Like, what a day. Hello, so weird too. Like, I wouldn't connect a British accent with these guys. I love the no noise. What? With Dumbledore? Oh no, we're gonna digging up graves right now. That's quite intense. What's your name? Dudley. Vernon Dudley. Check it. At least he goes along with it. Eh. <laughs> If this isn't who we think it is, Draco, and we call him, he'll kill us all. Did no one see what her last spell was? Oh no, what? Does it have like a... an archive? Like, they have so many people in their face in this movie. That sword is meant to be in my Whoa. Oh my God, how did you get it? <laughs> I didn't take anything! Oh my god, like this is the first time that we've seen her in this state, like so close to death. Okay. Could you take us with you? Of course, uh, I'm an elf. <laughs> it's so like, dude, do you not know anything? Oh, oh, Neos. Ron! Whoa, look at him! Oh my god, so amazing! What a hero! 
the little squeaks. <laughs> and the Step whole room out. went silent. You could kill me! Dobby never meant to kill. Dobby only meant to maim or <laughs> seriously injure. <laughs> Dobby is a free elf. And Dobby has come to save Harry Potter. Oh my god. Is this in time? On the... Is it gonna be sucked into... They're all like scattered, so the knife could be like far away, right? Shouldn't be a problem. On the... On the... Wow. Oh god, this movie went from very high to very low. Oh, he's so tiny. Look at his little hands. Why am I sad about an elf? Oh my god, like he came in so strong and it was like a full 10 minutes of like awesomeness and then they taken him away? Oh, like, oh. That is such a good punch. I'm in my dirty. Crying about an elf. <laughs> oh, Leowers. Oh. That's the one he needs. He's always like one step ahead. And this is gonna be the end, isn't it? Oh, no. <laughs> That's what you get when the movie is like two parts because you know that it's gonna end like in the middle. <gasps> Which already felt like with the previous one, to be honest. I was like, no way. Be here, it's even more like. They just like, you know what? Let's sprinkle some sadness onto you and some scariness, and then bye. See you in the next movie. Uh, I'm so excited though for the next one. I might watch it very, very soon actually. It's tonight over the top. <laughs> Maybe tomorrow. But like, it's crazy because I've been so invested now in this journey. And for me, this could keep going. I think I'm gonna feel really empty after the last one because it built up so much towards you completely falling in love with this world. And that's the thing with watching these movies close together, it becomes like a not a part of you, but you know what I mean, right? You start to get dreamy and think about the house you're in and the Patronus and how it would be like to live at Hogwarts. I just realized that we haven't been to Hogwarts, which is crazy because it's so connected to these books and movies. But yeah, I enjoyed this one a whole lot again. And I'm curious how they're going to stack everything in the next one, because apparently we still need three Horcruxes. I'm a bit confused now because I'm like, OK, so I thought it was four, but I guess it's three left. And also like the deadly hallows so it's just the wand that he needs to kill harry so he's got what he wants to kill harry now but harry still needs to destroy some horcruxes i think that's it but yeah i i like the nature of these movies a lot they have grown a lot darker i would not let my young child watch this and i feel like i like that because i can imagine that people also grew up with the books and the movies so that it was natural development as well for the audience that it targeted and i feel like as an adult this is actually really cool to watch as well so i had a lot of fun but i am <laughs> i'm really sad for dobby i wonder i haven't gotten a funko pop in a long time but i wonder if there's cute ones from dobby maybe because i feel like he would fit i hope you enjoyed this reaction i will be watching the next one very soon and uh, yeah, if you like it, make sure to like and subscribe. Full reactions is available on Patreon for you to enjoy together with me with some exclusive movies and Petrifold Soul and all that good stuff. So hope to see you there. And uh, I'll definitely see you in the next one. Have a good rest of your day. Bye bye.